Hey guys, just wanted to do a quick video on how to upgrade the RAM and um, SSD on the HP 15Z laptop. Um, yours may have a different config than mine. This one has the AMD Ryzen 4700U, um, the integrated graphics. Um, it came with 8 gigabytes of RAM and a 256 gigabyte NVMe SSD and then just the Wi-Fi AC instead of the Wi-Fi 6 chip, but um, basically getting the back panel off isn't too hard. There's going to be six screws. Uh, these two are visible. And then you're going to need to flip up um, the rubber right here, 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 and here. You can kind of just get it with your fingernail. Um, there's none, none in the middle. I did peel all of this off to check, but there was none in the middle. Uh, and then the sides are clipped on with um, just plastic clips. Kind of a pain, but um, if you're careful, they should come off fine. Um, it was kind of hard to get my fingernails underneath here, but I did find the easiest was kind of to start um, back here with the hinges. And I already have the plastic off just for ease of the video, but you kind of pull up there and then you can kind of get the corners loose. Um, so we'll take the back off here. And then, so it only, unfortunately, only has one uh, M.2 slot for an SSD. Um, so you can't add a second or, the, you know, there's no spot for like a SATA drive, at least as far as I could tell. Um, but yeah, so if you wanted to replace the NVMe, uh, make sure you get a PCIe one. It probably will take SATA, but, um, you know, why go with a slower one when you can go with uh, one that's fast enough. And then so you just undo this little screw and then um, you just, this kind of flips up and you put the new one in and put the screw back in. Uh, not very hard, just make sure you get one that's the right length. It's, I think that's the 2280, or I'll post in the video the correct size. And I'll also link to this one. This is a 512 um, Western Digital uh, Blue 550 drive. So it was about 55 bucks on Amazon. There are better ones, but this is for my parents. Um, so that should be fine for them. And then if you want to upgrade the RAM, um, it does uh, fortunately have two SO DIMM uh, sockets here, so you could just uh, replace those. I know a lot of laptops nowadays have soldered RAM, so that's nice. And so you just kind of push these little pins to the side, and then the RAM should flip up, come out like that, and then uh, put back in. Uh, so mine did come with 8 gigs, but I will be upgrading to uh, 16 gigs, just waiting on those to come in the mail. And if you did want to upgrade your Wi-Fi to like Wi-Fi 6 or if like a new technology comes out, um, just undo the little screw there, pop the antennas off, and then this will come out too, just like the NVMe uh, drive, and then just swap that in. Yeah, so just take your time getting the, the back cover off. It's not too hard. It did kind of stick in the middle, but if you kind of wiggle the cover, um, it should come off. Um, if you wanted to like replace the CPU thermal, um, paste you could take it off here and um, replace it there unfortunately the processor is soldered on so there's no uh, future upgrade pass but that's kind of how all laptops are for the most part nowadays so yeah if you guys have any more questions uh, post them down below in the comments and I will make sure to uh, link some of the um, upgrades that I used and um, subscribe if you guys want more content thanks bye